plays fair. The first pitch is down, and he swings and misses at it and got a smile on his face. Well, there you go, and that's home run number one of this derby. And it's pretty far up into those left field seats, and there goes another one. And he is going to come up short on his third, but he's got two out of the gate. He pulls that one foul. We'll find out early if the ball's carrying here, and that one does clear. There goes another one deep to left field. I believe that third one, Carl, tells you that it does travel. And during the daytime here, you have to take advantage of it because as soon as that sun starts setting, the ball travels less. What a start for Julio Rodriguez, another one that's left the building. About 10 rows up, and he is locked in. A huge shot, left field line. Nearly out of Dodger Stadium. You see the two stars, he's already earned his bonus time. And oh boy, is Julio Rodriguez making his first one memorable. Another. He's into double digits. 11 now. Wow. Julio doing what the month says. <laughs> Julio in Spanish, again, is July. This is his month, his moment, and he's seizing it. Oh my gosh. There's a... He's availing himself quite well here early. Any concern in the first two swings that he took? Right. Again, once he got the first one, it was like, okay, let's take a deep breath and let's put a show. And so far, he's put that show. All right, Marley, what do you got? And guys, one of the things you saw, Vlad Guerrero Jr. kind of rubbing his shoulders right there. And he said, take it easy, man. You got this. Wait for your pitch. You're going out too early. Boy, Vlad Guerrero going out too early. He's got 15 home runs already. That one has popped up sky high. He also said, I'm not interested in hitting the ball the furthest. I'm just trying to find a swing that gets it over the wall. I don't care how far it goes over the wall. Careful out there in left field, a line shot that clears what is a low corner. That's a lot further. Yeah, what a difference from the last two home run derbies that we witnessed, one in Cleveland in 2019 and then the last year in Colorado. High fence in Cleveland and left field. Mm. High fence in right field. So far here, it plays straight up from line to line, and that ball is out of here in a hurry. He hits him in punches, too. Once he gets going, it doesn't stop. Three big ones in a row after a pop out to center. Line shot will not get over the wall. 21 22 now. Carl, the beauty of this is that. The players down the line, they are watching. They're standing up watching Julio Rodriguez right now. You got Kershaw standing and watching this display that this young 21 year old is putting on. Last few seconds here. Kershaw standing. He's going to start the All Star game. And Rodriguez ends it with a flurry and a big fly. That's a Victus. 34 inch, 31 and a half ounce back. Julio Rodriguez, you see the distance right there with 463 feet, 107 miles per hour off the bat. And being congratulated by Mookie Betts. He's in awe, and this is the first of many that Julio Rodriguez hit, and it set the tone for the rest, Carl. So his first career regular season home run traveled 450 feet. His first derby homer travels 460. He will have another minute, and he is sitting on 25 home runs. If you're wondering about access to bonus time, he hit eight homers 440 feet or longer, eight of them. Carl, the ball's traveling. You, you see that man right now coming in also, getting ready, not only psychologically, but knowing what Julio Rodriguez has done. I believe that the pressure is always on the second hitter. If the first one can put the put a big dent into, dent into it, and Julio Rodriguez has been able to do that. Well, let's see how high he goes. He's at 25, he's got 60 seconds. Buster? You guys saw Mookie Betts walk up to him. He just told him, keep it going. And then we walked away. Mookie looked at me and said, I've never seen him in person. Oh, my God.
It's hard not to think of Ken Griffey Jr. when you see somebody in a Seattle Mariners jersey. Alex Rodriguez, of course, they share the same last name. Hitting moonshots here. I, I, I want to, even the BP thrower, let's face it, right now he's not even taking a step. It's all arm. He's being very accurate, and he's laying it in there for Julio. We talk so much about the hitters, but it's also about the guys that are throwing the baseball. And Julio Rodriguez continues to go deep because those are money shots and groove right down the middle for him. Oh, and here's that groove again. He gets on a heater and he keeps going. He's at 30. Line shot here, five seconds to go with 31, 32, and he will shut it down there. What a start to this derby. 32 shots for Julio Rodriguez and a standing ovation.